Hey guys, Coach B, Becca Marino, coming to you from Fitness Inspiration Inc. in Memphis, Tennessee, <clears throat> with our latest Getting Your Mind Right Mental Rep Video Blog of the Week. All right, so check it out. Um, this week's video, I'm going to highlight 11 awesome quotes. And why, do I, why am I doing this? I don't know about you, but I've had moments in life where um, I was going through a hard time, maybe I was feeling defeated, maybe my heart was hurting a little bit, maybe I was scared, um, and I was just kind of like having a moment, a tough one, right? And I happened to come across a quote, or I thought of a quote that I had heard in the past, and it gave me the inspiration or the oomph, whatever I needed to, to, to take the next step or, you know, to get my mind right and to continue moving forward instead of being stuck in a funk. So I think there's a lot of power in you know, inspirational words and, um, and quotes and things that have come from people who are um, out there, you know, making a difference or who have been through the tough, tough times and come out on the opposite side and stay positive. So I'm going to share those with you today in hopes that you'll find one that's awesome, maybe one that's going to help you now or might help you later. All right, so here we go. Quote number one from the man, Jerry Rice. Today, I will do what others won't, so tomorrow I can achieve what others can't. Number two, no matter what happens to you in your life, you alone have the capacity to choose your response to it. When you form the habit of searching for the positive in every circumstance, your life will move into its highest dimensions. This is one of the greatest of the natural laws of success and happiness. And that is from Robin Sharma. Quote number three, short and sweet baby, life begins at the end of your comfort zone. Neil Diamond Walsh. Hey, Tanky Poo. Um, I think that applies mental and physical because life begins outside of the comfort zone of the gym when you're feeling that awesome muscle discomfort and you know you're making healthy gains. Woo woo. Number four, Viktor Frankl. Between stimulus and response, there is a space. In that space is our power to choose our response. In our response lies our growth and our freedom. Between stimulus and response, there is a space. In that space is our power to choose our response. In our response lies our growth and our freedom. Number five. The cost of regret far exceeds the price of discipline. The cost of regret far exceeds the price of discipline. Number six, this comes from one of my awesome mentors, Todd Durkin, and it is ready, fire, aim. Why do I think that's an awesome quote? Because so many times, you know, we like try to Plan, 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 we gotta have everything together and we have to have it perfect before we take that next step. Well, you know what? It is okay in life to sometimes, you know, when you're feeling passionate and you just have a fire to ready, fire, and then aim. It ain't always gonna work out, but sometimes it is. So, ready, fire, aim. Sometimes you gotta take a healthy, calculated risk, all right? Todd Durkin, he's the man. And number seven, you cannot control what happens to you, but you can control your attitude to what happens to you. And in that, you will be mastering change rather than allowing it to master you. Kind of like the quote we heard about earlier um, about how, you know, we have a choice and we have the power and in that lies our growth and our freedom. We hold the power to make the choice, to choose. Attitude is everything. Number eight, love another, I love this one too, and it's short and sweet. John Cabot's in, wherever you go, there you are. I think this is awesome because y'all, at the end of the day, we, right here, this is it. It is you and yourself and you. And while it's great to have, um, you know, like, friends and coaches and 
um, and people in your life, it's super important that you take care of yourself and that you're okay with being by yourself and that your happiness doesn't depend on other things and other people, all right? So yeah, relationships are totally important. That's what life is about. What I'm trying to highlight with this awesome quote is wherever you go, there you are. And that everybody else isn't always gonna be around. So you are number one, taking care of yourself. You are completely happy and content with being alone. You are okay um, with doing stuff by yourself. You are okay with sitting and quiet and just being, all right? So wherever you go, there you are. If you don't know about Jalen Kevazin, Google that name and you'll see that's a pretty credible and awesome quote. Number nine, almost there. Believe it, woohoo, bring it, achieve it, baby. When I started this company, it took me a minute to come up with our little mantra and I think it says it all. Believe it, you believe in yourself and that you have everything you need to make whatever happen. You bring it by giving it 100%, not 95 and not 110. 110 leads to overtraining and burning yourself out. We can't give more than what we have. You give 100%, you work hard, and you will achieve whatever it is. And sometimes maybe we don't achieve what the goal is, but we achieve other things along the way. All right, so believe it, bring it, and achieve it. Number 10, the results you achieve will be in direct proportion to the effort you apply. Mm. One more time. The results you achieve will be in direct proportion to the effort you apply. My dad put it to me like this one day, focus effort, all right? Yeah, focus, make a focus effort and you'll get great results. All right, and my last one, my favorite one from Steve Jobs, at least my favorite one at this moment. Check it out. Your time is limited. Don't waste it living someone else's life. Don't be trapped by dogma, which is living the result of other people's thinking. Don't let the noise of other opinions drown out your own inner voice. And most important, have the courage to follow your heart and intuition. They somehow already know what you truly want to become and everything else is secondary. Your time is limited. Don't waste it living someone else's life. Don't be trapped by dogma, which is living as a result of other people's thinking. Don't let the noise of other opinions drown out your own inner voice. And most important, have the courage to follow your heart and intuition. They somehow already know what you truly want to become and everything else is just secondary. So those are 11 quotes that I thought were super awesome and kind of inspirational or at least helpful. Hope you've enjoyed this video. I will, my intent is to type these up and include it along with the text so you can refer back and um, know who said them. And yeah, so I appreciate your time. We'll be back next week, but between now and then, believe it, bring it, achieve it, and keep your mind right. Woo, see you soon, bye-bye.